Holzing in a nutshell. Lispatula kann nur schlimmer werden. Niemals. Let's go, boys. Thank you for the cheer. <coughs> Good start. T8 carrier. So we can actually shoot. We actually can protect. We might be able to prevent strikes. It just takes a T8 carry and a tier 10 massive AA boat to do that, but yeah. Let's get, Let's get started. Oof. Hello there. Oof. I wish everybody Crazy Ferret a great 237 day. just subscribed. Crazy Ferret, thank you for 13 months, 4 months in a row. You are absolutely amazing. Welcome back. Let's get let's get started. It's not fun for the CV. He can still outplay me. He just needs to spot me from a safer distance. Or know where I am with the first strike. Then I'm gonna trigger my A and then he, the people know where I am. So even if he is not able to do any real damage to me. Um he can be still a pain in the Yeah. Well, you know. I don't need to say it. He actually needs to try it a bit more, but he can still do a lot of for me. Like, just if he flies over me, keeps me spotted, losing all his planes, um, people will have time to shoot me. And that's the dangerous part for me. That's why I really think um, the rework, the spotting should be reworked. Afterwards? Hey. If, like... I'm not joking, if they would rework the carrier spotting completely, that it only spots the minimap, they could tune down the DPS on some ships. I wouldn't even mind that. And you know, I hate really carriers over passion. But for me, the biggest problem is not the damage. Although there are a few overperforming, it's really only the spotting. There are black grip. <laughs> changed my mind. <laughs> Good day, Johnny. How are you doing? Welcome. Oh no, Chad, do you see it? It's Skynet. We have to stop him! We have to stop him before it's too late! It's Skynet! <laughs> oh no! Now Haaland, don't do my toes. Thank you, person. I hope so too. Ah, oh, come on, bro! You no, no, don't need my torps, please. No, no, no! Okay, good. I'll help you, bro. Together we're strong. Oh, we lost him. Rip. He is, has way more DPM than me, that's true. But we can still trade good with him, because he was distracted. <coughs> hey, Xmas, welcome. Chat, I hope you're all doing well. You have a magnificent day. Today is gonna be the day where it's gonna be payback time for the frustration of yesterday. Let's go. And also probably a bit more warfighter than yesterday. Because you barely played that game. But I thought Skynet was inevitable. Winking Pot face. Potato. I am inevitable. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the biddies, bro. <laughs> let's go, chat. Let's go. Come on, GK. Don't don't proxy your height. Don't just eat ten torpedoes and make Treadless day absolutely beautiful. Yo, stolen. How dare you? <laughs> Bringing the bomb joke in already. I'm doing great. I'm really doing great, chat. Happy trendless, best trendless, let's go. Wait. <laughs> okay, let me rephrase myself. I'm fantastic. <laughs> I did not expect that, but I'll take it. Bye, Sherman. Good start, good start. That means the GK had no height reactive. <clears throat> mm 
<laughs> okay. No, yeah, go away, piggy. You don't want to lose your planes. Okay, he's gonna accelerate again. I feel that. And he's gonna turn in here. I'm pretty sure about that as well. I need to make it to the island because if you. I don't want to leave the cap. But if you raiders, I need to leave or be behind the island. I can't stick out of his radar engine the entire cap, so. Gotta do it like this. <coughs> mm. Am I gonna go for topping the GK? No, we're gonna top the GK first and then we're gonna go for recap. Yeah, we're gonna try top the GK first, then we're gonna go for B. We're not in a hurry at the moment, we're leading. We're having a good points lead, we're having cap. Okay, this is a bit annoying, but it's not changing the core plan for now. Ultimo is about to die. DK is fully tunnel visioned. Oh, we're gonna lose a few tops here. Yeah, freaking wargaming island mechanics. My, my bad. That was my own fault. I launched them way too close. Hello, Baltimore. Engine boost Would be a shame if you don't have a heal, right? Ah, not yet. <clears throat> Let's get B. Ah, so close. He is healing. Finish him off. Don't let him heal, boys. Get the GK right here. Good job. Good job. I have a strange feeling that the Bismarck might yolo me. So we gotta have the tops ready soon. Okay. And thank you for creating a hype train, by the way, chat. You're amazing. You're absolutely amazing. <clears throat> Our team has taken the lead. They still have a druid, but he's nowhere near the cap. So that's good. We have any more information the about the Baltimore? Sight. No, not really, right? He must be hugging the island. I can't explain it in any other way. Ah, there it is. Concentrate fire on Come the on, boys! Get the Baltimore. You can do it. Druid is in sea cap now. Okay. We're not gonna fight the Druid. That would be just suicidal. And I'm not joking about it. That would be just suicidal. Good, we know what. Actually, <coughs> the druid is kind of low. Engine boost deactivated. Mm. He does have a heal though, which we should not forget, and way more DPN than me. Now we're gonna defend B. We're not gonna risk it. Oh, my bad. Sorry, I did not plan to do that. Alert. I fat fingered. Oh, torpedo prediction on Bismarck is pretty good though, so that's nice. All stations requesting fire support. Nice. I wish that people could finish off the Baltimore. The Baltimore is out of the game. But it still would be nice for the points. Remember to remember, Baltimore has no heal. <clears throat> Victory.
victory is in sight. Yeah, he's smart enough to not eat the torch. Problem is, it is the druid. He will outgun me. Not anymore now. Now he's pretty much gone. The problem is, there's still a Merc and a Derry. We do have another heal up soon. My biggest problem is, and in case you don't know it, <clears throat> usually what you can do against a druid player, if you're in a fight and you kite away, you can go nose away, so to minimize your damage on you. The problem is, um, with Halland, Smallland and Ragnar, you can't directly aim your guns, for example, forward or backwards, because they're blocked by certain things. Which is a bit of a shame, as you can tell. I'm not gonna go in there. I know Druid is slow, but the problem is Daring will back him up so shortly. Okay, Druid is dead. I didn't know he's that low. We destroyed their destroyer. Engine boost activated. We'll take it though. Okay, there's the Daring. I actually expected the Druid to have a tiny bit more HP. <clears throat> oh well. We traded really good with him. Let's get him out of the smoke stream. Bad bro, I have backup. That's the marker. Torpedoes direct front. Oh, these torps are coming a little bit of a pickle. Oh, close, 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 but we dodged. Good. Torpedoes are stern. We need to watch out, Merc AP. We need to show full broadside now. So is Shellstone Arm. Okay, we got him pistols. But when you fight a Merker in a ship like this, or like the higher German DDs, they have improved AP angles and massive AP damage. So what you're gonna do is show full broadside and do not angle. <coughs> what is better DBN, Daring or Halland? Uh, Daring should be having better DBM. Even if it's not, uh, it lands shells when we're consistent. Good. Good start, chat. Let's finish off the Daring as well. And we did a pretty good job. Roger. Otherwise, we would hit him. Ah, there we go. Yeah, he reversed. Okay, he dead. Good. That was way better blind firing from him than from me. But GG. Whew! Good start! Eliminating the DD threats, getting the caps. I think this is a really good start. 
Let's help in capping B now and then we can instantly go to C cap and the game is won. <laughs> Battle ends in five minutes. Engine boost activated. How long? Oof. How long do you? Oof. Okay, wait for a second. X Max seven hundred and thirteen just subscribed. Can you play Slava? Yeah, sure. I can play Slava afterwards. Thank you for three months, bro. Really appreciate it, and welcome to Golden Head. Yeah, I'll play Slava afterwards. How long? Take three line on the elbow. Does the show broadside apply? Well, well, what's going on? Yo, okay, we're back. That was a big hiccup on my internet, um, but um, it basically applies the whole, entire time because if I'm not mistaken, the entire line has 150s, right? From the start on, it does have 150s, right, chat? I'm not sure, but it should be. You guns have a lot of power, so they will always overpen on, like, unless it's a really thick destroyer. But yeah, Xmas, I will play Slava next game. <clears throat> the moment, like, for example, if I engage an Elbing, and the moment I'm using my second gun, his improved AP angle is just gonna eat me alive, because he can score up to like 7k salvos and just completely annihilate me. Wait, what just happened? Why did it say Waifu Detonator? Did I miss something? Waifu Detonator, thank you so much. <laughs> Appreciate it. If you're here. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah, it's Gates <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Slava or Vampire 2 Trainers? Which one is more fun? Vampire 2. I mean... Vampire 2 is the overall better ship, that's what I mean. Fun can be both, but yeah. Talent, Dreadnought, 4 kills, 2 kept, uh, captured, 1 assisted capture. We're back in business, boys. Uh, just below uh, first, but I guess he got the place because of the plane kills. So, GG. Great game. Good start, chat. We're back in business. <clears throat> Oof. Oof.